Hello everyone and welcome back to Clinger 2. Today I'm going to be showing you what I like to do to get a gunship and I feel the easiest way to get a gunship on shipment. Um, starting out here, the class we're going to start out with is I would like to pick the origin for this. You can really choose any gun you want. Um, you're going to really want that tactical and parallel on there for extra range basically. Um, everything else, it is recoil stability. That's all I put it on there for. You really want the 25 drum round mag. That is a necessity for this so you won't stop shooting pretty much. Um, it's a really nice thing to do on shipment. You have to be kind of close with the origin, but it's the shipment, so everyone's pretty close in the first place. Um, the RPG is a nice attachment or gun, just literally because you can get an easy two kills with it. Um, you want kill chain, you want hard line, third perk doesn't matter a whole lot. Definitely want kill chain and hard line due to the fact that your kill streaks can actually chain into the next kill streaks, which is very nice. Um, the frags and everything like that don't really matter a whole lot. They help out in some cases, but not like from what I've seen a whole lot. Um, you want a precision airstrike, you want a sentry gun, and of course the gunship. Um, yeah, I'll show you why you want those later. And uh, yeah, you definitely want the uh, supply box. It's it's helpful in some cases, but sometimes it just it's only there if you actually run out of ammo and your RPG bullets, since those are just easy kills. Um, pretty much what you're going to want to do is, since Hardline makes the Persistent Airstrike 4 kills, you just want to get 4 kills real quick, which is pretty easy to do on this map. Um, you just kind of run around the map and just, it's going to take some time, but not a whole lot of time. If you play it a few times on shipment, you'll pretty much get the right pattern down and you just might be able to go in the back of the enemy spawn and just wipe out their whole team. Um, so what you're going to do is, like I did right there, um, you put down the sentry turret outside your little crate, and I know it's a little bit camping, but I mean, it's the easiest way you're going to get this, so sacrifice have to be made somehow. And the what's going to happen is, is if you use the precision airstrike first, and you don't have the sentry gun, which does happen a lot to me, odd times in this, where you only get four kills, you'll just use the um, you'll basically use the precision airstrike while you're in the crate, and then put it on the crate, so then it shoots over the crate, so you won't die from it, and it gets you pretty much an easy two kills most of the time. And put down the sentry turn and it does the rest of the work for you. And you basically get the gunship right after that. Um, you really just have to wait a few minutes, a few moments, I mean, not minutes. And most of the time, people run in front of it. I haven't really ran, ran to an issue that much where people try to actually kill the uh, sentry turn. But if it does happen, you're so close, you can actually just melee them or you can just shoot them with your origin and get those kills anyway. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much how you get the gunship easy. Have a good day, everyone, and hope to see you again soon. And bye. Oh, yeah, the rest of this is just going to be me getting the gunship. Um, the last half of this is me getting the gunship twice in one game. So, yeah, everyone have a good day, and uh, thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.